hi, welcome back again to another episode of uh, Urbex TV here. We're back at another location that I once visited before and uh, it seems to be a very popular place. Um, the reason why I decided to come back is that the first time I was here was at night and I didn't really have really good lighting. And uh, from some of the photos that I've seen that the inside the interior is actually very nice during the daytime. So we're going to go on in and uh, hopefully we won't have any problems uh, with the owner because I know that the owner lived next door in the back uh, in the extended part so we're going to go on in and uh, take some photos a little bit more video so that you guys have a better and clearer uh, view of what I had experienced and missed most of the during the night so let's go it looks like that we cannot get in because it looks like it's been vandalized, unfortunately. And as you can see here, that uh, I'm looking inside. Oh yeah. They, they knocked down the scaffolding and everything that was in there. You can see that they locked it up. So, one more time, one more for the vandals who ruin it for us explorers. Uh, so it looks like I'm not going to be able to get inside unless I can speak to the owner and ask him to see if he can open it up. But uh, we'll take a little look around and uh, see what we can find, okay? So I managed to find a way in, luckily. There's a side door open, and I don't think they planned on it. Oh, wow. I don't remember this place being this trashed. You see, I've never been in this part of the building, so this part is exposed. Last time I came here, I think that the door was locked. But from what I can see here, uh, the place is pretty trashed. So we're going to take a look around and uh, hopefully get some good footage for you guys today. Really, I didn't know that phone, the phones would be working in here. Should I answer it? Hello? 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 I know you're there. I can see you. Okay, that is weird. Okay, so... Like I said, I've never been in this part before. Because I was told... Wow, this place goes on forever. I was told by Vince, the guy who brought me here, that somebody was actually living on this side. Still all the dishes and everything here. Getting to see place this part of this place I haven't seen. Whoa. This is absolutely 
absolutely creepy, guys. I just wonder if there anybody's going to in here. Hello? Anybody in here? This place is like a maze. So it seems kind of interesting that they trashed this place. Let me see if I can get my camera here. It seems to be kind of interesting that they trashed this place. Um, most of the stuff I didn't even get access to the last time I was here, but it's a shame that people just destroy everything. All right, so let's continue around the place and um, we'll go into the main chapel and we'll take some photos after. Okay, I believe this is where I came from. There's just all kinds of space here. Whoever it was, they really destroyed this place. Hello? Okay guys, don't forget to hit that like button and show your love here for Urbex TV for all of these urban explorations. Now I'm in sections here that I have never been. There's like a, okay, this place I remember. There's like a dance hall and stuff down here. Everybody gets excited when they see a bathroom. So look guys, we got some toilets here. so much more here to see during the daytime than when I was here last. We have access to pretty much everything. I'm kind of glad that that side door was open, that I would have missed out on all this. This would be my last probably opportunity to come here and do this. really been smashing lights and stuff here on the floor. Oh, they got a wheelchair. I didn't notice last time when I was here they had a wheelchair. Wow. 
they're going to kick down the doors in here. Looks like that leads to somewhere. I don't know if that leads up to the roof, the, where the bell is. I don't know if that's safe to walk on at all. I won't try it. So there seems to be a lot of little nooks and crannies in this building that I didn't see the last time I was here. So I'm going to completely scout out this building, see what's in here, ooh, spiders, cobwebs. So once I have the bottom area completely scoped out, we're going to go upstairs and take a look inside of the main chapel area. So don't forget to smash that like button, guys. And uh, if you have any comments down below, by all means, uh, let, let me know if you have any questions or you want to know a little bit about the place. I will try and get a little bit more research on this building for you guys in the video if I can. So you see here from the last time we were here uh, it got quite trashed so it's only going to be a matter of time now before this place come becomes completely vandalized um, if they don't completely lock up this place so it's kind of a shame But uh, there's something that I always want to do while I was, if I ever came back here, and I'll show you guys in a sec, okay? All right, so we're gonna to continue to take a look around here. Unfortunately, I forgot to empty my, my SIM card and I have like almost five hours of stuff stored on this. So I had to remove some stuff to continue filming. So hopefully that won't deter us from continuing today. If worst case scenario, I'll just buy another SIM card, SD card. So uh, last place we're gonna check is we're gonna go take a look up here and uh, show you guys from the top view, all right? So 
So guys, I hope you liked this video. Uh, it's becoming a very well-known church now. Uh, I'm not going to reveal the location just because I don't want uh, the vandalism to get any worse in here because I have a feeling that uh, this place will be locked down until they decide what they're going to do with it. I, I, I'm assuming that they're going to demolish this, this church and uh, there'll be nothing left of it. So, again, like I said, it's kind of cool that I get to come back here. A lot of people I've seen, like uh, Freakdo Photography has been here. Um, I signed my name on the, the, uh, the stand or the mantle that's there. Urbex TV. <laughs> and uh, that's it. So, thanks for... Thank you guys for watching my video. Today is going to be a special day. After I leave here, I'm going out and I'm searching for more places for you guys and for me because the thrill of exploring is to go out and find places to explore. So I'm going to end it off here with this as my backdrop. And, and uh, don't forget to hit that like button, man. Like, take this ladder, okay? and just smack your, your like button. How about that? And uh, if you have any comments, you know where to put them in the comment section below. Whoa. And uh, that's it. So I'm gonna finish off my day here, take a few more photos and a uh, little time to relax and then I'm off to another location. And uh, hopefully, uh, It'll be on the next uh, video for you guys. And uh, that's it. So don't forget to uh, subscribe to Urbex TV if you want to see some more of this stuff. And uh, shout out to all my friends, my new fellow friends, my urban explorers that uh, I've been watching and who've been following me and I've been following them. And uh, hopefully that uh, one day we're all gonna get to collaborate together. All right, so thanks guys. Until next time, ciao bell.